Hello, this is Mark Sabatella, and in this video, I want to share with you uh, my one of my very favorite intervals, which is the tenth. And as a pianist, especially a pianist uh, playing certain types of music, ragtime, stride piano, it's nice to be able to play tenths in our left hands. And I can kind of sort of do it, but not really. I really have to stretch, and some of them like this one here I'm just not going to make, right? So I'm not talking about those kind of tents, cool as they are. What I'm going to talk about here is an opportunity to play tents between your hands. And this isn't just for piano. This could also be between a bassoon, a, a clarinet, say, and a bassoon, or a violin and a viola, or whatever. And so the idea is I have a melody here, and I'll play my melody with just the roots in the left hand. Nice simple melody, kind of arpeggio up, step down, arpeggio up, and another arpeggio down, right? So it's it's a very simple type of melody, a common type of melody that we hear a lot, and it's going to work in many cases on melodies like this to harmonize it with a note a tenth below in the left hand. Let's take a look at what that will look like. So uh, here are the notes. While I play an E in my right hand, I'm going to play a C in my left. G against E. B against G. And notice that as I'm arpeggiating up, I'm also arpeggiating up basically the same chord in the left hand. And now I'm stepping down, and the right hand has chord tones and passing tones, the left hand has chord tones and passing tones, and it just kind of works. So I can play that whole phrase. And it all just kind of works nicely, sounds good. You don't always get lucky like this. You might end up stuck with some non-chord tones in your left hand that in places you don't like, and that's fine. If it doesn't work, it doesn't work, but when it does work, it's really a, just a, a lovely sound, and you can find examples of this harmonizing in tense like this. You can find it in Bach, you can find it in Chopin, and, and you can certainly find it in jazz pianists like Bill Evans. So it's just a, an interesting trick to have in your uh, bag. So I hope you enjoyed this little exploration of tense.